Hi everybody, good morning. Um, I'm standing here with Scott and we thought we'd throw together this uh, very quick little video on the um, Fountas and Pennell system because we're getting a lot of confused emails um, about requesting ERI or leveled readers or level literacy intervention in uh, preparation for this conference next week or the seminar. And I thought I'd do a, just a quick overview of what this is so you know what we're talking about. So about six years ago, we bought, Joy approved the purchase of the Fountas and Pinnell um, systems, the orange system, the blue system, and the green system. They're about $5,000 a piece. And um, you know, that's a lot of money, but anyway. So what I wanted to do was show you what, what a system, what came in a system, okay? So with the system comes the teacher's guides, okay? So there's two teacher's guides that comes with the system. The program guide, okay? Prompting guide, this one here. And when readers struggle, and also um, things like a uh, you know a calculator nobody uses a calculator anymore, and the actual um, CDs. So these are the CD technology package, but it's also available online. And I sent everybody out a link with the passwords to that online system. Um, along with the items, these particular professional resources that are in the uh, in the package. There's the My Writing Book, many of you will recognize that. The Big Book, okay, and these folders. And actually, we also they also came with uh, book bags that students could, um, you know, take home the books and a set of the black and white take home books. So that's basically what each one of these boxes comes with. With the professional resources that come in the system, you also get all of the little books. So in this orange box there are 70 books, the green 110 books, and the blue one is 120 books. I bought these books in the beginning, needless to say, putting one system in a, in a, in a particular classroom at a site denies everybody else, you know, all the other kindergarten teachers and teachers, um, the opportunity to use it. But also, um, we didn't buy them initially for the purposes of intervention. They were bought to give teachers leveled readers, properly leveled, to conference with students individually, one-on-one, -on -one, or to do intervention one-on-one. -on -one. Um, not in a classroom where you've got 25 kids and you're taking four or six out. So what we did was this, to try to make sure that we serviced all of our 10 kindergarten classrooms, or I think it might have been more than that, 11 or 12, and our DD programs with students working at a kindergarten level and also our grades, um, you know, one to four, what we did is we divide the systems up into these little bins. So all of you will recognize these bins. You have them in your classroom. We decided to distribute them so as many people got them as possible. On the front of the bin, it tells you the lesson number and the number of books inside the bin. So each bin has the number of books, so you know, 1 to 15 or whatever it is, the actual leveled readers, the numbers on the back, and you also have the print section of the book, of the teacher's guide that that comes with, plus you have the set of the corresponding take-home books with this little one in terms of take-home. Hopefully many of you still have the little bags or you have, you know, substitute bags so that teachers can share these in a site that they're possibly and we're able to distribute, um, you know, do with the best we had with, you know, the three sets over all of them. So that's why you're seeing it like divided up like this. Um, in the beginning, we tried to do it in a way where people reckon, you know, they requested a set and then we would send the sets out. And then, of course, you know, Joanne wants to keep them for the year and you know, Christy would like them as well, but it just it just didn't work out that way. So that's why we ended up putting distributing, so at least everybody had a set. So as I said, four little books came um, 
in each of the sets, there was one, four copies of one title of each of the 70 books or 110 books. So we distributed into three sets, over three sets, and we kept back a set, a master set, so that we could replace any books that went missing. And in the first few years, that's exactly what happened, basically. Even though we did ask teachers to keep the books in the set, when you're sitting with the student, take the book out, conference with the student, put the book back so that they're not in students' book bins, they're not out in the regular collection. Things happen, so books went missing, and so we used those, that sort of reserve set that we had to um, replenish any things that were missing. So basically that is just a little background on the um, Fountas and Pennell set and uh, I can't remember whether I said but um, we um, because of the uh, you know we went with actually buying the sets because we found that it was cheaper to buy the set that came with all of the items then go in because you actually can go onto the Fountas and Pinnell site and you can buy the books separately but then if you buy them separately now you've got to kind of like assemble assemble them this way it actually turned out to be more economical to buy the sets than to go in and buy the individual little packets of four so I hope that gives you a little bit of a background about where you know why these came about but every Kindergarten classrooms should have a set of either the, you know, well actually kindergarten will have the orange set or if you're in grade one and up you would have, you know, the blue or the green set. Um, so if you have any further questions about that, please don't hesitate to email us. But hopefully that clears up some of the confusion around you know, early, you know, people have been asking, early reading intervention, which is actually something else. It's another kind of little manual that came that's from 2000 that, you know, came from a uh, Winter Tickle Press. So that, this separate from this Fountas and Pennell leveled literacy intervention kit. Okay, so I will send out again that uh, online, the, t the link to the online teacher's guides. And um, I do believe that it's possible, you know, if it turns out that the prompting guides are useful, I would have to check on the Fountas and Pendle side, but I do believe that these, um, these uh, books can be bought separately. So I apologize for my appearance here this morning. I've got an eye infection and we weren't ready for this, but anyway, so um, good luck at the workshop and uh, let me know how it goes. See you next time.